Okay, so from the point <laughs> where you met Kid, oh, when you met Big, around six, seven years old, how did y'all create a bond from that point, you know, to high school? Well, when I first met him when I was a kid, you know, graduating from public school, around that time, I just knew him because he used to be around, he used to be hustling on Fulton Street. So okay. I used to see him just from going to the store and he always just sit there, say what's up to me, we pass by. Then once I became like 11, 12 years old, you know, I was trying to be a little grown kid. I wanted to be out there doing what all of mm-hmm. my little friends was doing. Because all my friends were two, three years older than me. Nino Brown and, and uh, you know, Bugsy Chico and all of them was a little older than me. I used to be following behind mm-hmm. them. And whenever they used to go hang out on Fulton Street, I used to be going out there and i hang outside. It was right around the corner from my house. I'd come outside, go to the store, and I'd probably been going right back around the corner. I would just sit outside with them on, on Fulton Street. And right. They'd be like, Yo, go take your little ass around the corner, man. Mm-hmm. Go, go get in the house. And I'd be just sitting out there just... Trying to mingle in, and, mm-hmm. and that's kind of like how once I became. What does your mom up, say about this? Like, was she furied? Was she pissed? Like, my mom didn't know. She didn't, you know, she didn't know what I was doing. Same way Miss Wiles didn't know what Big was doing when he was outside. You know, mm-hmm. once once we go home on St. James Place, that side block, we're cool there. But once we went on Fulton Street, it's oh, a yeah. whole another atmosphere. Mm-hmm. And they don't know. I'm just, hey, mom, I'll be right back. I'm going to the store. Right, right. But my store trip would be. But then you get cars getting sent home. Like, um, C's did not come into school today. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. Well, once I got hot from get your that, ass she, beat. yeah. Like, nothing oh, like... Oh, no, no, no. My mom's was, uh, yeah. No, I would get beat for my sister. No, no. My mom's was very, like, uh, my mom's... I couldn't do no wrong to my mom. You know what I'm saying? Because you're the baby. But, yeah, I'm the baby. You know what I mean? She's not going she to terrorize her baby, but that's how my sisters was. Like, mm-hmm. They was like, you're not. This ain't your... Don't be out here doing this and that. Because one of my sisters, you know, my oldest, she was out there in the streets. You know, mm-hmm. she grew up in... And that whole lifestyle, hustling and, and running around the streets. So she was the one that used to put me on to everything. Like, you want to be out here doing that? And you want to smoke this weed and do this and that? Be careful. Because right. if this happened, you know. She was always schooling me. And uh, that's kind of like how I learned about the streets mm-hmm. and all that, you know. What she, age were you when you left home? Uh, When I went on the road with Big, I was 13. Wow. I was 13. His first couple of promo tours, his first couple of promo runs, when he, when he just had... Real love out in Dolly My Baby and Party and Bullshit records. Mm-hmm. I was only 13 years old when he had them records out, and I would go do like little shows he used to get bookings for in North Carolina and Virginia, like little local spots. He would, I would jump in the car. Like we would ride around little buckets sex, and hoop drugs and rock and roll. Yeah. Getting in clubs at 13 years old. I was in the tunnel when I was 14. Mm-hmm. 15 years old. No ID. I was driving at 15 years old. Were you and Big ever roommates? Roommates? Mm-hmm. Yeah. At times I had to shack up and pull out the, uh, you know, hotels had to pull out couches and all that. You had to, go. yeah. I used to do those. We used to get little sweets and stuff like that. He had to make sure I was there. He had to, he had to monitor me because that's the. That's right, because you were a minor. Agreement. Yeah, that's the agreement he made with my mother. Mm. Like I'm gonna make sure he's alright. I'm gonna make sure I take care of him. Don't right. worry about him. And I was always under his supervision all the time. This is something re- real random. What was Big's favorite cereal? Uh, I can't even. Uh, <laughs> Did he like cereal? I don't remember us eating a lot of cereal. No, <laughs> big, big ate like a big man. You know, nine in the morning we was eating big ass flaming young. Good night. Uh, now, who uh, was cooking? Oh, it it, it could have been Jan. His his mother was a. Uh, Oh, she won't let her she won't let her son starve. Miss Wallace, no, she's West Indian. I mean, I'm talking about we was eating peas and rice eight in the morning. <laughs> curry goat, curry chicken. It's it's, it's red snapper fish. You, you uh, do you cook? Now I do. Oh, uh, what's your uh, specialty? Uh, I mean, I don't know how to cook too much, but I know how to you know some grilled chicken. Ain't nothing to put some grilled chicken on the well, floor. Well, you can't or, eat grilled chicken grill. every day. A fish. Okay. Uh, I could put some steak in the broiler. Oh, okay. Five but we minutes, don't eat steak no more. No more. Yeah, but it's before it's before oh, okay. I, it's before I got off my diet. But that was like the main stuff when I first started working out. I, I used to cook the steaks and mm-hmm. the fish and. The, the grilled chicken and the foreman grill came out, make it a lot easier. You ain't gotta do nice, a lot of seasoning. Mm-hmm. Just you know, season it right. And I used to marinate my chicken and, and marinate the steak, marinate. leave it in the, yeah, leave it in the refrigerator for about two days, let that marinate, soak in, and out there on the foreman grill or put it in the broiler. Uh huh. Stove. Five What's the minutes vegetable game sides. like though? Uh, I really don't do that. that. That was my only downfall. I didn't know how to really do the side. The, the, you ain't making side, no like greens. That. Nah, I I go buy that from somewhere. <laughs> I, I go you know buy that. I, I cook the meat and all that myself, but I go buy a little side orders. Sometimes I cheat with a little mac and cheese. Okay. You know, or sometimes you I, I do the steamed veggies. Yeah. 
Not the box now. The box. Definitely the box. Oh, sage. Yeah, definitely Al Good number luck. nine.